Can you change up the envelopes? If you want something that has a little more range to it. Now, at the same time that you're doing this, you can actually have both filters going from the same sources. So if I want to send one and two to that filter and also to this filter, I can do that. Another way I can do that is if you look at the patching here, I can send it either to here right away or up to here. If I turn all of these off, but I turn this left arrow on instead of the right arrow, it'll actually feed the signal from this down to here. So if I throw all of my oscillators onto this filter, I can automatically feed to here, or if I turn it off and send it to the amp, I can uh, only patch my third oscillator on there. So look at this. Turn that, it goes off. However, if I throw my third up here, now it's feeding straight to the amp. So let's look at that again. Stop that for a second. Turn this off, throw my third up here and throw it in this way, and now it's gonna go through that filter. Hear how it's a lot thicker? And now I can filter all three at the same time. But again, if you don't want that, and you wanna keep one and two unaffected by the filter, what I can do is assign it this way, and assign my third over here, like we saw before. Okay, so you're hearing that third is uh, being affected by the filter, so I bring it all the way down to here. And let's change up the kind of filter I have on that, because I want a different type of sound. Something a little bit crazy from a comb filter. And then I bring up these filters here. So bring up the balance. Notice how that's not affected by this at all. 